What is up, Rocket Nation, and welcome back for episode number 62 of Horizon Zero Dawn. In episode number 61, we made our way to Gaia Prime. We learned a whole lot about Silas and also retrieved some master override codes that were needed for us to destroy Hades. And that is where we're going to be picking up today. Let's jump right in. As always, if you enjoy the episode, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Share it on your favorite social media platform so that others might enjoy it as well. And if you want to be notified when the next episode goes live, all you got to do is be subscribed to the channel. Click the little bell notification icon deal thing and YouTube will take care of the rest. Now we're going to be starting off today's episode by, uh, I think, turning in some power cells. Um, we may have collected the fifth and final power cell that we need for a quest that we've had for quite some time. I do believe it is right here is where we're going to be going. The quest is called Ancient Armory. An ancient suit of armor lies in a rune of the old ones, visible but out of reach. Find a use for the power cells. So it is that way. It's this way. 130 foot deals. So right around the corner, not that far away at all. We might as well grab some of this stuff on the way as well. Uh, some healing things might be needed. <gasps> Can we jump and then jump and look at this amazing vertical leaps that she has. And I think this is our spot right here. Now, I had to come in here before for a uh, a flower that we needed. One of the flowers that we needed. Uh, I think we're just going to jump for it. Nailed it. So one of the metal flowers that you have to actually get is right here on the left-hand side. I had to come in and grab this. It was sitting right here in this triangular flower pot deal. This Bunker. It's a ruin. Bunker discovered. Ooh. Look at it. What does this say? Ultra Weave trials let's let's read this let's read this ultra weave mk 7.1 trials october 65 that would be 2065 um notes weave is not tightening properly on local impact tests we need to optimize existing sensors and add more sensor optimization successful but torso protection still lagging recommend increasing weave density Getting there on the weave density and detection components, but the integration error on the left knee tank the impact test. Ouch. Subject isn't going to be able to walk that one off. Surgery required. Uh oh. I don't want to put this on now. All right. So, okay, these, I believe, are the power cells. I think the old ones use numbers like this to indicate time. Ah, the time. All right, so examine breakers. These devices are missing power cells. I'll have to find power cells to get these to work. Like five of them that I have? Repair the fuse. Do it. Stick that there. in there. Fits. I just need to slot in one more. That's two. It's some kind of code. Maybe there's a clue nearby. 12 o'clock. 1500 hours. What time is that? <laughs> is that three o'clock? I think that's three. No, nope, wrong one. Maybe there's some more information nearby. Something that will looks like each dial has four positions. Um, maybe if I get each dial in the right position. All right, 1800 hours. That would be the downward direction. 2100 hours would be here. Did it. Oh. Now to check the door. Easy peasy. Those clamps have the armor locked in place. Maybe there's a way to power up the mechanism, release the clamps. Got a whole bunch of stuff there. Oh, let's take a look at this. Oh, that is amazing looking. Out of this world. All right. So I think we need to go to the other side, if I remember correctly. And uh, there should be some more power cells. Got to jump over. I need to install these power cells. That should do it. All right. Repair the fuse. Only two more. Just one more. There we go. The last one. All powered up. These numbers. They must be related to segments of a circle. 
90, 270, 360, 450, 630. Is that what that says? I can't read it. Oh, way easier like that. So 90 straight up, uh, 270. What would that be? Down? 360. What? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I was just trying to stand up. I don't want to crouch. Stop crouching. 450. Oh, that was the wrong way. And 630. Is that down? This is a complete guess here. That is not correct. <laughs> 90. Uh, I guess I don't understand what it wants me to do here. Would it be... Oh, my goodness. So, okay. No, I think this one is going to be... All right, let's do this. Right, left. 360. That would be up, right? Yeah, so that would be in the right one. Okay, and I think it's just going to be... Right, left. Is that it? Did it. There it is. Okay. Let's have a look at that armor inside. I literally just had a main a, a brain meltdown there. Like I think I stroked out for a second. All uh, right. <laughs> now let's see what we can do with this material. Oh. Pick up shield weaver. Ooh. Completed side quest ancient armory. Nice. Shield Weaver outfit box we just received. So inventory, treasure boxes. Uh, we're going to the final one right here. Shield Weaver outfit box open. Shield Weaver armor. Now, if I remember correctly, this is like the OP armor. Like this is it's too much. Shadow Stalwart armor we also got. That's allow us to, it's supposed to allow us to blend in. But that's the armor right there. Ancient technology salvaged by Aloy and stitched to Noro leather. Protects and a damage absorbing force shield takes time to recharge when depleted. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's so cool looking. Oh, that's BA. That is so good. Shield Weaver armor accepted. Um, We're not going to use it right now. <laughs> it's, we went through all that trouble. Probably not going to use it. We're just going to put back on the uh, the stealth armor. For now. What is that? Survivor Silent. Yeah, the Silent Hunter one. We're ridiculously stealthy in this. Like, almost machines ignore us half the time. Ignore us? Nora? Nora us? <laughs> it's not that funny, Rocket. Not that funny at all. All right. So, the next up thing that we're going to be doing is uh, the next main quest. The Looming Shadow. This says, main quest. Hades intends to use the spire to transmit a resurrection signal calling millions of buried machines from their graves. When the time comes, Aloy must stand against the shadow, but she will not fight alone. Go to the Palace of the Sun. This is 17,000 XP and one skill point. I'm gonna start the journey over there. I will meet you guys. Uh, why did you put the thing right on my face? <laughs> I will see you guys once we get there. It'll be just a second. Ah! All right, welcome back, Rocket Nation. Only I have sold all of the things. Yourself. We are 100% ready to and rock here. So let's make our way up to the Palace of the Sun. Um, I think we are closing in on the very end of the game. I think we only have like maybe one or two missions left to go. Um, I think we've done all the side missions in the game that I have been able to find. So, of course, if you guys really know really of any side quests that I yes. haven't done, be sure to shout it out in the uh, comment section. Because uh, I don't want to miss anything. Talk to Sun King Avad. I do like Avad. Avad seems like a genuine dude. Oh, he's all done up. Aloy. What brings you to Meridian? A threat. Helis commands a legion of fanatics called the Eclipse. They will attack soon from the west. 
with an army of ancient war machines. But that's not the worst of it. They'll bring a mind with them, god, demon, machine, whatever you want to call it. It's called Hades. And it doesn't want Meridian at all. It wants the Spire. And if it gets there, it will send out a call, waking more ancient machines, more than we could ever defeat. All will be lost. We can't let that happen. Just laid it right I'm trying on trying to understand, but my responsibility lies with Meridian. Meridian isn't the target of Odd. You have to defend the Spire. Perhaps the Vanguard, your Radiance. Yes. Send them to the Spire. Aaron knows Aloy. He won't question it. And have the City Guard fortify the Western Ridge. There they can be seen to protect Meridian and the Alight, where the Spire rests. Aloy. Allow me to... apologize for my behavior before. After everything that happened with Ursa, <laughs> I was confused. He's still hung up on this? If we're to fight together on the brink of life and death, I'd prefer to do so with your forgiveness. Then you have it. As long as you don't confuse me with her again. Even a king can learn his lesson. Good then. I'm... I'm glad that's behind us. Awkward conversation now, over. It will take time to prepare our defenses. Please, tell me what you know of our enemies. Everything. I don't know about everything, but I'll tell you what I can. It's not good. It's real bad. Uh, talk to Blameless Murad. All right, let's go uh, talk with Murad real quick. He's down here. Rod, where are you? Quietly does it. Panic in the city will only create another enemy. And do keep me appraised of each new arrival. Wait, where are you going? Don't... Okay. Ah, Aloy. Preparations are underway on the rigid defenses and at the Spire. Word was sent to every corner of the Sundom. Our allies offered their steel. Some came for Meridian, others for Shards. But many came for you. My name for me don't be so humble the ridge the ridge will be the front line that's where the city guard are holding yes bolstered by some of the uh, irregulars i spoke of before the osaran cannons that thundered meridian's walls in the liberation will now defend us you're welcome to tour the defenses um the spire and the spire Erend and the Vanguard are there? Indeed. Uh, clashing breastplates together and testing out their battle cries, I suppose. A number of the Nora have also arrived at the Spire. They have resisted the offer of a royal audience. Perhaps you could parley with them. I will. Parley! Um, that's still what happens now. I suppose all we can do is wait for the attack. Exactly. It's not a feeling I cherish, but our spotters at Evening Sign report there's still no movement in the West. So, if there's more you need to do elsewhere, seize this time to do it. Otherwise, I've made the apartment of Olin Delverson available to you. <laughs> you can sleep there, if sleep comes. Go rest at Olin's place? <laughs> It's not awkward at all. Review, review preparations at the ridge. Review preparations at the spire. Both optional. I think we are going to go do both of those. I think I want to. Whatever you can find. Damage Welcome file repaired. That's one of Elizabeth Sobek's uh, files that just got repaired. No, no. Has the enemy reached the main gate? No, no. I'm down. Everyone needs a splash of color in their lives. Come, let's talk it over. All right, um, I think, you know what? I think I am gonna make my way down over to uh, the preparation areas and see what is going on on those. And I will bring you guys back once I'm a little bit closer. So you guys don't have to watch the entire walk down there. So see you guys in one second. Uh, I guess we'll start at the ridge. See you guys in a second. All right, Rocket Nation, welcome back as we're only about 90 foot deals away from the ridge fortifications here. Let's see what is going on. See how these preparations are coming along. Have you just polished that armor, Uthid? 
Of course. I bet those uh, isn't that a little will just convenient what? Lose Nothing. And transport Out with this woman. Forget I said anything. You look very dignified. Thank you. And shiny. Very shiny. <laughs> <laughs> There's Tab. <laughs> Let's talk to these two. I want to see what's up with them. Little Huntress, you called, so here I am. Vanasha! Ready to fight? Fight? I thought you just wanted tea and conversation. Is there a battle coming? I wasn't informed. Well, that can't be true. You're always informed. Ah, so I am. We've only met a few times, and yet you know me so well. I don't think I know you at all. But I'd like to. Hmm. When I hear that line, it usually means something else. Can I tell you a secret? Of course. I've been waiting for this fight my whole life. The enemy we face today is the same that turned Meridian into a slave pit and Sunfall into a bloodbath. Fanatics who torture and murder mothers, fathers, families, children, and say it's the will of the sun. I hate them, Aloy. I've got the scars of their whips on my back to prove it. And today, we can get rid of them once and for all. I said I came for you, but that was only half the truth. I came for them. This time, they're not getting away. I'm with you, Vanasha. We'll fight them together. And I won't forget it, little Huntress. Tomorrow, may the sun rise in a better world. Yeah. Too much Osram influence. The Talk house. to Uthid. Aloy. Um, at ease, Uthid. Meridian will be glad to have you on its side. And I am too. The honor is mine. You saved my epitaph from being a fine soldier, but a fool of a man. I'm <laughs> hoping you won't need any kind of epitaph just yet. As the sun wills. When you found me, I was trying to eke out a glorious death. But now... A glorious life seems more preferable. To watch Edelman play in the low gardens again. Still surrounded by a dozen guards, but... What you did, Aloy... It was done well. Although, I can't shake this road. Vinasha. She delights in goading me. Like brazen colors waved before a behemoth. <laughs> Do you want me to ask her to stop? No. I accept it. Well then, Meridian shall stand and shadow shall fall. I swear it. Here's to that, Uthid. Uthid, oh. It's so cool seeing all of these characters that we have met before. All right, let's talk to Tab. Tab, my buddy! Aloy, I told you I'd be here. You did, Tab. But have your wounds even had time to heal? Honestly, if I fought, I'd probably come undone. But don't worry. I'll leave that to the other Nora at the Spire. I brought supplies instead. These Karja have made me an honorary quartermaster, whatever that means. <laughs> it sounds impressive. I could get used to it. We'll be setting up caches of arms and medicine under these banners. Look for them when the fighting starts. Aloy, when you went into the mountain, did the goddess tell you our chances? She didn't need to. I know we can do this, Teb. Maybe we can. Just lie and tell him 100% chance we're going to succeed. Uh, I don't mean lie. I mean tell the truth. Because that's exactly what it's going to be. Uh, definitely nothing bad's going to happen. tried to kill the Sun King. Hey, who's this? Hey, Alita. Alita, I'm, I'm pleased to see you, but what are you doing here? I'm helping prepare for the battle. If a troll were here, we would have fought together. I know it. So I'm doing everything I can. Digging battlements, collecting herbs. Anything that makes a difference. I can't take his place. Nothing can take his place. But I'm here for him. For both of us. I understand what it was he saw in you. He'll always be with me. Sun and shadow still meet for a moment. Every dawn and dusk. I should give you this, to help in the battle. By the sun, I hope you don't need it. Thank you, Alita. Be safe. What'd she give us? Antidotes? Three antidotes? How Ooh. many men do you think you'll kill in the battle, Luthid? 
As many as I have to. Soft. I love awesome it when you say things like that. It's so... What's he think of letting what? Live? Cheerful. <laughs> Nikoa! She's here! You came to fight. How could I not? During the Red Raids, there was only one Karja Butcher the Nora feared more than Zaid. Zaid. Helis. I would stand against any army he leads, no matter how strong. For the Nora he terrorized, for myself, and for my father. We'll stop him. You have my word. Your word means a lot, especially now. Because of you, I hear the sacred land is opened. If we win, I can go home. It'll be good to see Jan again. I'm with you, Aloy. Until the end. Okay, her quest, her brother actually sent us after her uh, because she had left the Nora homeland to hunt down one of the generals that murdered her father right in front of her. His name was Zaid. Uh, it was a very cool quest. Man, we're seeing all the... Geneva! She was the warden of... Uh, what is it? Sunrock Prison? Geneva. They called you back to duty. So, you're the one behind all this commotion. Who made Sun King Avad finally show his sword arm from behind those robes? A king can be fierce and fair, Geneva. He's a good man. A smart man, too. He had Murad offer all my prisoners a royal pardon if they'd fight for Meridian. <laughs> the whole motley lot of them agreed. Didn't take much convincing. With your kind of convincing, I don't doubt it. Ha! This time I went easy on them. Those who commit the crime of attacking Meridian, they'll see less of my lenient side. Leniency? May the sun blaze at your back, Aloy. That's a nice spear, Uthid. Thank you. I like the way you grip it. Do they got a thing going on? Seems like they may have a thing going on. And I think it's awesome. Oh, there's a... Oh, I forgot about the attack dummies. Look at how amazing our spear is now, by the way. There's another dummy across the way. There's another dummy across the river. I mean, besides this dummy. There's another one right there. Is this the final one? More than equipped to take you on. More than equipped. Take that. So I may have missed one along the way somewhere. Uh, because I did not get the achievement to pop for that. And I believe that's where you're supposed to get the achievement to pop. Um, oh, look who it is. My girl, Petra. You brought your weapon, my baby. Petra. Here she is, the guest of honor. I knew there was something about you. Hammered from the stuff they make leaders out of. And I don't say that to every Nora girl who blows through my town. That happens to you a lot? <laughs> Had to build a wall to fend them off. <laughs> Good thing I'm persistent then. <laughs> I've missed our little talks. Murad asked me to look over the city arsenal. These guns have aged well. That runs in the Osram, no? They were the pride of the Mainspring Forges. So I've taken greater pride in improving them. Um, that needs some... <laughs> need me to test that out for you? Can I try one? Everybody wants a turn. Have at it, then. The target should put up a little less of a fight than those bandit raiders did. Uh... I broke them, I think. <laughs> Pretty sure I broke them. It hits nice and wide. No need to aim it like a bow. Take that. Die machines. Oh, that is so cool. I love this thing. I love it, Petra. You're a wonderful woman. All right. So that is all the preparations that uh, need to be reviewed here. I think we've talked to everybody. So cool seeing everybody from all the missions that we've done and all that we've done throughout the entire story. But all right, let's uh, go ahead and head to the next spot. Uh, I will meet you guys over there. We're, oh, we're going to the Spire now, aren't we? Yeah, we're going all the way to the Spire now. So I'm going to head over to the Spire, which is right up there, which now we know what it is. Now we know it's a transmission tower, but uh, I will make my way over there and I will see you guys when we get there. 
all right rocket nation welcome back as we stand at the base of the tower now of the uh of the spire and i figured i would take the walk up with you guys oh you're the hunter from the banuke grove i remember you also nora the machines shook free of their slumber after you arrived raged and fought uh well that that wasn't my fault no i'm thanking you that night i decided i would not go back to banur I would take my hunt into these lands. So many machines, even demons, spidery, skittering, without the blue light in them. Dead things that must be killed again. Our enemies dug up an army of them. An army? Yes, that's why I came. Good. I'll wait. Uh, now, that quest was for a gentleman up in Meridian. We actually went to a uh, Banur camp. I believe it was it might have been this one yeah banuk encampment where they uh all the beasts and the machines there uh were essentially like they had been already overridden uh and it turns out that uh some of the people from meridian had went there and they had messed with a set a crash satellite that was essentially putting the machines at peace and uh everything went crazy and during that entire fight she was there talking about uh, I think she was screaming about sh she was glad that the hunt was back is what she was calling it. The great hunt. She did not like the fact that they had not earned the peace from the beasts from the machines. So during the entire battle there, you could hear her uh, talking about it. Can't remember the name. I wish I remembered the name of these quests so I could. Uh, yeah. Tell you guys where you meet all these people from. This is so cool. I love this. We, I kept forgetting to make this journey up to the spire, so I figured I'd bring you guys along on it. And now I'm super glad because, of course, there's people along the way. Um, Talana! Talana, why are you here? I'm your hawk. Where else would I be? Defending Meridian with Avad? I leave that to the rest of the lodge. I will not stand aside while one of mine fights alone. Not again. Are you sure you... You're risking your life for all of us. You can't ask me to stand by and watch. Not when I have the power to change it. Then I won't ask you. It's settled. I will fight by your side. My only request... Name it. Leave the biggest machine for me. <laughs> no promises. Absolutely not. Talana, of course, the leader now of the uh, the Hunter's Lodge. We met her during the Hunter's Lodge quest line. And uh, yeah, she we fought Red Maw with her. Red Maw being a uh, legendary, a legendary Thunderjaw. Wow, look at that view right there. Good Lord. This game is gorgeous. Right, keep going. So we have three different spots to check out, it looks like. And there is the Spire. This is something I kept seeing off in the distance and I would mention during episodes, but I just I kept forgetting to come here over and over again. It rises taller than the highest tree. These cards are in their frilled armor look like turkeys, but there are so many. And now we are so few. They are not our foe. Not this time. Quiet now. She comes. Quiet United. now. Anointed. <laughs> so this is the Nora. There's Sona. Of course, we met Sona as part of the main quest. War Chief Sona. War Chief, you, you seem uncomfortable. The Nora do not belong here. I do not belong here. I will fight the metal devil that threatens us all. But my place is in the sacred land. The wrongness here jags at me like an arrowhead. I'm sorry to put you through this. Head. Do not be sorry. This will be ended. My spear, my word. All right. Sona the only one that we can talk to? Yeah. I wonder if we can see Rush. Rush was, uh, if you guys remember, was the one that gave us a hard time uh, as we were growing up uh, as a Nora outcast. Hey, it's Varl. Varl is Sona's son. Greetings, Aloy. Don't. You don't need to bow. The anointed doesn't like it. She doesn't much like being called anointed either. <laughs> right? It means a lot to have you here, Varl. I gave my word. 
So, Meridian, what do you think? I've seen many new things since I first met you. I should thank you. For all what's wrong. You really want to know? All right. I'm in a foreign land, a tainted land, defending a faithless city that looks like nothing I've seen, from something I can't imagine. And you, after all that's happened, all you've done, I feel like I should drop to my knees and worship you, but I know you don't want that. Boy, things are pretty tough for you, huh? Thanks for telling the other Nora not to bow. It's the last thing I need. <laughs> don't be too hard on them. They only joined this fight because the Anointed bid it so. Is that why you came? No. I would have come just to see you one more time. And we must fight a metal devil because the goddess says, or because you say. I think the goddess and I are in agreement. We're both glad you're here. So am I. Oh, Varl's got a thing for her for sure sure we look around i don't want to miss anyone uh before we go up there let's look around over on this side there's been so many adventures that we've had along the way now it's like man i don't know is there a person down there no all right i guess this is the last one i love that they put this in the game really do so who are these guys? They call themselves the Eclipse. Of course. What does that even mean? It's when the moon gets in front of the sun, idiot. <laughs> Is that supposed to sound scary or something? I don't know. They used to be Karja. Karja are always yammering about sun and shade. Well, if they used to be Karja, how tough can they be? Yeah, they're best guys just like birds. We'll rip their little feathers off. <laughs> and let's not get cocky. Wow. Boys. Be ready to fight, is all we're saying. Aaron! Aloy. <laughs> so here we are again, gearing up for a fight. Only this time it sounds like the bad guys have a lot more firepower. What are we up against, really? I'm not sure. But there's going to be a lot of them, and they'll have machines. And if they get past us, it's not just Meridian that will fall. The rest of the world will go with it. That's big. It sounds like our kind of fight. Right, guys? Well, where do they put the vanguard? At, At the, the front, front of the line! line. <laughs> and why? Steel before iron! And what are we gonna do? Hit them like, like a hammer till they, they can't hit, hit back. back! Damn right! You hear that? Nobody's getting past the vanguard. We're here for Meridian. And we're here for you. Thank you, Erend. Ursa would be proud. Well, only if we win. All four of them are here for me. So we visited both defense sites. Is there anything up top there? I don't think I'm gonna be able. We gotta. We gotta check, right? You have to check. Another one of Elizabeth Sobek's damaged files been repaired. No. All right. So. Uh, I guess it's back now to the uh, Royal Palace. So I will head back to the Royal Palace and I will see you all when I arrive. See you in just a second. All right, Rocket Nation. We are under 50 foot deals away. Let's make our way over here. Where do I got to go? I got to go this way? This way. This is the way. This is the way. I have spoken. Oh, we're going to go rest now, I think feels empty should i sleep did i leave anything unfinished i think that might be the cue that maybe this is going to be the end of it that might be it um all right well rocket nation this is where we're going to end this episode i know there was a lot of talking in this one but i think that uh this was definitely worth the watch so thank you guys so much for joining me. If you guys enjoyed this episode, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Share it on your favorite social media platform so that others might enjoy it as well as we prepare for battle. And if you want to be notified when the next episode and the big battle actually takes place, all you guys got to do is be subscribed to the channel. 
click the little bell notification icon and YouTube will take care of the rest. Thank you so much. And as always, remember, life is short. Pause save and I will see you in the next episode.